But um, do you think that's our best hope to build this program and to build this um, team up? Is it through transfers or should we still be focusing our efforts on attracting top high school recruits? I, I just don't think that Oregon State has done a good job of attracting good high school recruits over the past few years. So I think maybe taking some time and going out there to find people that need that second chance, people that can mm -hmm. actually play, guys that can come out and show intensity, have had the experience at a bigger school than any of the Pac-12 schools, and especially Oregon State, bringing that experience in and changing the culture. That's one of the biggest things that needs to happen is Oregon State needs to change it the culture. I mean, right now it's obviously a losing culture. Everybody you talk to, oh, we don't look at Oregon State. Mm -hmm. Oregon State is just another W on our list. Okay, but if Oregon State turns around from a losing culture and actually gets these good players from other top schools, giving them that second chance, I think that Oregon State turns that culture around and then we start attracting more high school, you know, top prospects. But I don't think it's it's not going to happen until we have the talent here and, you know, the resume of for so people would actually want to come to Oregon State yeah. other than just it being the best college town in the Pac-12 yeah. certified and stamped. Um, well, that's kind of interesting because that leads right into our final topic. Another way I think that we can raise the caliber of our school or the respect of our school is having that players, alumni that have NFL success, right? Obviously, one reason a top high school recruit is going to come to your college to play is A, they want to win a national championship. These are top of top, right? They want to win a national championship. They want to compete for conference championship or they want to get the best chance to prepare for the NFL, right? Mm. And Oregon State, we had a couple draft picks this year, Jay Glue and Isaiah Hodgins, who we've kind of touched on. But do you think if those guys could go on, hypothetically, say they had two, three years from now, they're impact players on their respective teams, how much, if any, do you think that could help a team like Oregon State um, recruit prospects? I want to say – that it's going to help. But I mean, look at the people that we do have as our alumni. I mean, like we have a first battle hall of famer in Chad Johnson, Ocho Cinco, either way. Um, and TJ Hushmanzada. I mean, if that's not enough to bring people in, I already, I just don't know what more they could do. Maybe in the future. I think if we get more people into the NFL, it's going to help, but I just don't see us having arguably a first battle hall of famer. And, you know, in our resume here, and we still can't get more than three-star recruits. 